give a damn about a hater when I feel like it. Not today, not today, not today, not tomorrow. Get out my way, please. I'm trying to get paid. Not today, not today. Yo, what's going on? I am here at JB Hunt Terminal in Concord, North Carolina. I'm here getting my uh, decals removed and getting my GeoTab uh, GPS uninstalled from the truck. Today, well, last night was officially my last day, last load for JB Hunt. In the future, I would do it all over again. Um, yes, obviously with probably a more economical truck payment. Um, I'll be returning the truck to SFI today uh, as soon as they get done with my decals. Um, it's about a 30 minute drive from here. It's been, um, it's been a good experience. I absolutely enjoyed my time at JB Hunt. I just became more and more curious about flatbed and I wanted to broaden my horizons. I, I think I got to a place where I became bored or stagnated with um, drive-in because, you know, with flatbed, there's so many levels to it. And with drive-in, the only other level is reefer. And I've done that before too, uh, when I was with Hirschbach. Anyways, y'all, continue to stay on the journey with me. I have picked a company that I am going to be going to. Excuse the sun glare. I'll try to move away from that. I have picked the company that I'm going to, and I'll let y'all know more about that when the time comes. But yeah, it's been real. I appreciate all the love and support. Uh, I appreciate all the comments, whether I approve of them or not. Your comments are welcome. Just come with respect when you come. That's all I ask. Other than that, um, it's been real. I would recommend JB Hunt to anyone if in case you want to know. I'd recommend them to absolutely anyone. I would even re recommend them to myself in the future. If flatbed didn't work out, I may come back. Depends, you know, I'll see. But I'm going to give flatbed this good fair shake. Anyways, y'all, that's enough of me drawing it on. Sorry I sound a little dry this morning. The coffee ain't kicked in yet. Anyways, y'all, y'all be good. Y'all be safe. I will document the journey and I will let y'all know how things go. All right, sir, when you come in, you're gonna go past the Seal Island. You're gonna park that truck in Bob Kill Parking. Once you park that truck, just come in with the key. Uh, do I come inside the main building? Getting one last look at the truck, guys. I am officially done with JB Hunt. I am here actually at the Schneider Terminal where I did orientation at back in March of last year. As you can see, truck number's been removed. Decals are removed. Uh, just one last look at the truck. Uh, saying goodbye to him, I'm about to get my rental car about to head to my new destination. It's been real, red, maroon, whatever color you really were. But yeah, I'm about to walk into SFI um, here because like I said before, 
when you turn in your SFI trucks, please one, make sure you do things the right way. Two, when you're turning your SFI trucks, there's someone else getting a JV Hunt truck. That's a nice Volvo. That is a really nice Volvo. Um, <laughs> y'all, sorry, I got distracted. And there's a plane up above, so please excuse the noise. But yeah, I'm about to go turn in my SFI truck. Y'all check out that tanker. That tanker set up right there. But um, I'm about to go turn in my truck and um, you know, it's bittersweet, but when it's time to move on and God tells you to move, move when God tells you to move. Don't hesitate. Don't question. If God say move, you've prayed about it, you've asked for it, and then he tell you to go, go. Don't wait around. Do not collect 200, <laughs> you know, all the good Monopoly puns and whatever. You just, you just, God tell you to go, so just go. And that's what I'm doing. And I am 100% confident that I'm making the right decision. Other than that, I've already let JB Hunt know. Obviously, I, <laughs> you know, I had the decals taken off. Anyways, y'all, enough of me drawing on. I'll let y'all know more in the future about the paperwork and process side of it and how um, that goes with fees I'll be uh, met with and how does that get covered. Anyway, y'all, it's been real. About to head right in there, turn these keys in. Ladies and gentlemen, just arrived at orientation. As y'all can see, flatbed trucks galore. In case you hadn't already figured it out, you can see if you can see the decals or not. I am here in Birmingham, Alabama, at a little company called Boyd Brothers. Yes, I decided to go with Boyd. There are many reasons why. We'll get into that later. Just a quick look around in their facility. This is where the drivers are parked. This is where you'll park at when you come to orientation. There's a lineup of their trucks. I'll try to get a uh, closer view of the trucks. Yeah, hope y'all are doing good this morning. Like I said, I'll go into detail later about why I chose Boyd, but I chose them because they were the best for my situation. Are they the highest paying? No, they're not. But they were the best for my situation. So yeah, let's look at some of their trucks. White truck, blue truck, they have, I believe, Internationals and Kentworth T680s. I like that blue truck. That's what I want. Uh, still on the fence about company at least, but they told me to just come anyway and just figure out what I want to do when I get there. There's a training center over there and a guard shed. All right, that's pretty much all y'all get for now. Just want to give y'all a quick inside view of the terminal. I'm not going to do a lot of talking because I don't want to be disturbing the keys. Upstairs is where recruiting is. Smells nice in here. There's different rooms. There's a room with a printer, I guess, if you need to print out some documents or something. Um, here's what they have their list of million mountain drivers. Two millions and your one millions. Sorry, y'all. Somebody's <laughs> having a conversation. Hey, good morning. Good morning. And they have showers here at the terminal. One, two, three, four, five, six showers here at the terminal. I'm clean and dirty. Child baskets right there. 
men and women's restrooms right there. machine over there. trucks are like, I did like their signature truck. Walking over here to their training center so I can get started. Y'all know I'm gonna document the journey. They got some more bobtail parking over there. <sighs> it's a little cold out, but that's all right. It's gonna be a lot colder when I'm out here doing this in other places. But let's get it, y'all. I'm ready. I'm armed and strong. I am not scared of a challenge. Not now, not ever. Here's where they do some of their classes at. Uh, I did it here so you can see the signs, but that's what they do. Low securement. And here's the orientation classroom right here. All right, let's get it. <laughs> 